Many homes and businesses across Maine sustained damage in the multiple storms that battered our state over the last month. From fallen trees to flooding and more, owners are now left to survey the damage and decide what to do next. If this sounds like the spot you're in, TV5 spoke to some experts to get their advice. They say it's important to keep priorities in mind. If you have an emergency fund, this is the time to tap into it, but be intentional about what you're spending your money on. One of the things that you you look to do when you are first encountering storm damage is to assess the circumstances and the situation, right? And then you can determine what things need to be addressed right away and what things might be able to be addressed come spring or summer. Emergencies can hit at any time and they can be weather events, they can be health events, they could be the loss of a job, they can be an accident in a car. There's too many unforeseen things so we really wanna make sure that we reserve that emergency fund and right after we tap into it, the very first focus has to be to build it back up. If you don't have an emergency fund, financial planner Jack Arbor says to read the terms of any loans carefully. He says look for ones with the lowest cost and fastest payback. Once you're in a spot to build an emergency fund, he says you should have at least three months of operating costs set aside.